my name is Tammy Frank and I am the Senior E-Commerce Specialist here at Rampart Supply. Call or email me if you'd like to schedule a demo or training session with you or your employees. In this video, we will go over everything you need to know about customer part numbers. A customer part number is a unique identifier you assign to a product to make it easier to find and order on the website. You must be logged in to create and use customer part numbers because they are unique to your customer account. The customer part number screen can be accessed by clicking on my account and then customer part numbers under the product and order management section. If we have existing customer part numbers set up for your account in our backend system, those will be displayed and work on the website. However, any customer part numbers you set up on the website will only work on the website. By default, the first 25 customer part numbers are displayed, but you can change that by clicking the drop down here. Or you can search for a specific customer part number by typing it in the search box. Searching by product description works as well. You will see a quantity box, the current price, your customer number, and the product description. Customer part numbers not only allow you to search and order by your unique identifier, but you can also order products directly from the list by entering a quantity you would like to order next to the desired items and then clicking on Add to Cart. Similarly, you can add the item to a wish list or product group by entering the quantity and then clicking Add to List for the wish list or Add to Product Group and then creating a new group or selecting an existing one. See the video on creating and managing product groups for more information on this feature. If you need to edit existing customer part numbers, click Edit Customer Part Numbers, make the necessary changes, then click Update. To create a brand new customer part number cross, navigate to the Product Details page for the item and select Customer Part Number, which can be found here. Enter the part number in the box that appears. And even though it's called Customer Part Number, you can actually use any combination of letters and numbers to create one. Then click on Add. You will see the Customer Part Number if one is set up on the Product Details page right under the Part Number field. Once Customer Part Numbers are set up, you can enter that number in the search box and locate the item and you can use that part number in the quick order pad to add it directly to the cart.